G'day and welcome back to Dave's Epic Slotcars. Um, today we're going to be looking at a another auto union. This one's a V16, 366 cubic inches, and it was Ferdinand Porsche's Radical V16 engine. It was a perfect fit for the Grand Prix racing new pre-war formula. So the motor is a V16 supercharged Type C. Um, at a top speed of 195 miles an hour, 1936 model. Now it had 520 brake horsepower. It won six out of the 12 starts. Um, the driver on this one is Bernard Rosemeyer. Um, in 1937, the Mercedes come back and they upped their game with the W125. And the Type C was unable to match. Now this model, is a model by George Turner from the UK. Now, unfortunately, then this is no longer available. The wheels are from Penelope Pitlane and um, with photo, photo etched inserts, which look great. Love the look of these things. But um, come with a steel Chevy, as you can see. Really nice looking. Um, and very well done too. The casting is really clean. Very smooth. Doesn't appear to have had too much work done on this, but very well detailed as well. It's got um, you've got the um, the coupling for the uh, starter, so the big electric starter. They would shove on the back. I don't know whether they used air operated ones later on, but certainly electric battery job. Um, it's it's it really is a good looking car. Dashboard wise, you can see the gauges, the hoop, big wood steering wheel, alloy spokes, the driver, there he is there, hanging on for dear life, um, auto union on the, above the radiator there, really a nice looking car, and not a bad weight neither, it's got a good feel to it, very big guide, have a go at it, uh, yet it handles very well um, on the routed track. So she's a, she's a good model, comes out, come out very, very nicely, very well built by um, Jimmy Paul Jaffa from Victoria. Now he built the other one, I've got at the back there as well, and uh, he's done an awesome job. They look really, really nice, so um, good on Jimmy, awesome. And uh, yeah, so anyway, this is only really a short one really, I suppose. Let's have a look at it on the track. Okay. It's time for a test. Looks good on the track. There must have been something to see these things going around in real life. He gets up and goes. It must have made some hell of a noise with the V16s flying past it. Anyway, it looks pretty good, goes good, handles not too bad. Hmm, she's a handful, because I turned the voltage down on it. Um, damn nice car, nice kit, very well put together, together with, um, by Jimmy, and um, yeah, very, very good. So there's the two of them. Anyway, if you like this sort of video, Give us a thumbs up, maybe, and let subscribe, or like a bit of a like, comment, all that sort of stuff. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. See ya.